R Hopper uh, 320 asks the following question. When you cut an angle, uh, when you cut the angle board, if one of your angles is, is less than 45 degrees, the other side of the angle is greater than 45, right? Well, that would be correct. Um, how did you use your markings to cut it uh, with your mark miter saw? Uh, does, your goes, does yours go farther than 45 degrees? Let's go out of the shop and uh, answer that question. Near as I can tell, Hopper's question is related to the angle brace of a gate. Uh, his question was on one of our gate videos. And his question was, if, if one of the angles is like 30 degrees, uh, does that make uh, you know, the other angle 60 degrees? I guess technically it does, but let me show you how it's done. Let me give you the, the final, uh, final answer uh, right off the top. These two angles will be level. Okay, let me go ahead and uh, cut them and show how it works. Okay, first uh, I cut my, I cut my, I put my saw at 30 degrees. It can be 30 degrees either way, 30 degrees this way or 30 degrees this way. Okay, and cut my angle. Okay, now you can see that there's the 30 degrees right there and so I know that this angle so there's my 30 degrees right there I got it I got it sitting flat down here so I know this angle has got to be parallel to it so it's going to be like that and I actually mark it like that so I don't get confused over the saw let's go back to the saw okay so now I know I got that I got to cut that angle right there so I come over here to my saw So now if I put that, put that board up there, both angles are 30 degrees. This is 30 degrees from this side and on, on the, this side over here. And this is 30 degrees from this side. And they're both parallel. So I hope that answers your question.